certain things happen to you as the sign of the love of Allah. One of them is he tests you in a way that draws you closer to him. Inna Allah idha ahabba abdan ibtala. When Allah loves a slave, when Allah loves a slave, male or female, Allah tests them in a way that brings them closer to him. And this is why when calamity strikes, when negativity happens to you and I, think to yourself, has this drawn me closer to Allah? If it has, it was a blessing and a sign of the love of Allah. And if it drifted you away from Allah, it may just be a punishment. It may just be something negative because of the sinful behavior that we at times have. May Allah forgive us and strengthen us. So not every negativity that will happen in your life is a sign of the displeasure of Allah. Remember, there are some who turn to the clubs and the pubs when they are sad. And there are others who turn to prayer and patience when they are sad or when they've lost something. The same loss has led two different people to two different things depending on their belief and how strong they are in their connection with Allah. Which one are you? Are you the one who becomes depressed? Are you the one who becomes a person who questions Allah and who turns away from Allah just because he has tested you? If that's the case, my beloved brother and sister, here we are today reminding you not to do that. Allah is merciful. Allah knows what he's doing. Perhaps in your negativity, there will be so much positivity. Just give it time. Just be steadfast. Continue in your patience to say the least. When you see the reward of that patience on the day of judgment, like I said, the accounts are taken. Allah does not wrong anyone. He will reward you for the patience that you endured, even if it was a lifetime. Some of us have seen struggle from a young age and we continue to struggle. Don't worry. Allah knows about it. Allah is watching. Even if your matters were not resolved on earth, when you see how they will be resolved in the hereafter, you will appreciate every droplet of patience that you endured. That's Allah. This is the accounts that Allah delivers on the day of judgment. He has promised this.